Hi Sagittarius, this is Wendy from Wendy's Tarot. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to go ahead and ask the cards, what does your person think about when they think about you? What does your person think about when they think about you? All right, let's go ahead and get started. Just as a reminder, this is a general reading. It might not resonate with everyone, but if it resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. All right, let's see, spirit angels and guides, please show me what does this person think about when they think about Sagittarius, whoever it is that Sagittarius is connecting to and dealing with in love. All right, Sagittarius, first card we have here is the Six of Cups, the Magician, the Chariot in Reverse, the King of Cups, the High Priestess, the Two of Pentacles in Reverse, and at the bottom we have the Four of Swords. Yeah, I do feel um, Sagittarius, I feel like this person, what they think about when they think about you is how much they miss you. I'm getting a strong energy of this person missing you a lot with the Six of Cups here. This, also, this person also wishes that they, that they could manifest you into their life or back into their life. You might be dealing with someone who practices witchcraft or divination or some sort of spiritual ritual. For some of you, this person has been trying to use those um, means to, to try to manifest you back into their life. Especially because we have the High Priestess here and the Magician. Both of these cards can represent someone who practices um, Wicca or witchcraft or some sort of um, spiritual, I don't know, alchemy. <laughs> yeah, like spells or incantations or... Um, Law of Attraction, something like that. I do feel like this person feels a very strong spiritual bond with you, like a spiritual connection with you. Um, this could be a twin flame type of energy or soulmate type of energy. Um, it doesn't mean that you two are twin flames or soulmates, um, but I feel like this person sees you in that way. They do see you as a possible soulmate or twin flame. There is an obsessive quality here, even though the devil card is not present. I do feel like there is an obsessive quality here um, coming from this person, Sagittarius, towards you. Um, keep in mind, roles can be reversed. I do feel like this person can stop thinking about you, Sagittarius, with the Four of Wands here. Uh, four of Swords. And the Four of Wands is at the bottom of the deck. So there was some sort of falling out, some sort of breakup, separation. And I feel like this person has been heartbroken here. They've been feeling heartbroken. Um... But yeah, this person thinks um, that you are missing them a lot and that you are thinking about them a lot. And that you want them back.
or they want you back i feel like they want you back actually um you know i feel like i'm reading um yeah i'm reading their energy i feel like this is their energy they want they want to have a reconciliation with you they feel like there's unfinished business with the world card in reverse there might be long distance between you two with the three of wands i feel like this person feels sad about the the long distance that exists between you two justice card they want to make things right again they want to make things right with you and they want things to to move in a positive direction between you and them so i mean i asked the cards what do they think about when they think about you Yeah, that's really what they think about. They think about how much they feel empty without you, how much they miss you. Sagittarius, obviously, it's not for everyone. It's not going to be everyone's story, but I do feel like this is someone who's very kind of obsessed here with you, Sagittarius. And they are they are wanting to manifest you into their life. Tell me about the Magician card, Spirit. Yeah, they want to have a relationship with you with the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. They want to reconnect with you with the Three of Cups. Again, this is that's what I said. They're trying to, to energetic you, energetically pull you towards them. I don't feel like they're taking any action with the chariot card in reverse. They're just using kind of the law of attraction. They might be making them trying to make themselves more desirable in some way. All right, um, Sagittarius says, take a look at how do you feel about this person? Okay, I'm going to try and make um, some contrast here. Or look at some contrast and see how do you feel. Spirit angels and guys, please show me how does Sagittarius feel about this person? What are Sagittarius' feelings for this person? first card we have here is page of cups in reverse ace of swords in reverse knight of swords in reverse the star card in reverse the emperor high priestess in reverse and the king of swords upright actually i'm gonna pick some more cards here let's get three more Page of Swords in reverse, Page of Wands upright, and the Nine of Pentacles upright. So in regards to your feelings, Sagittarius, mm, let's see. Ooh, there's a lot of pages here. Page of Cups, Page of Swords, Page of Wands. Hmm. Yeah, it does feel like Sorry for my dog, by the way. There is there is a, a connection here. There is a, an emotional connection. It does feel like it's cr it creates more pain than anything else. The the connection that you two have with each other. Um, it feels a little bit unrealistic for some reason. And I feel like you're thinking of it in that way. You're thinking that it's unrealistic. It's like when two people want to be together, but there's too many external factors or circumstances or overall challenges that are not conducive for you two to be together. 
successfully. Um, also, I feel like there might be a difference in age between you two, or just a different a difference in lifestyle or um, spiritually. Also, you two might just be at different levels because I feel like someone is older and and the other person is younger. Doesn't have to be literally. It could just be in you know energetically. It, there is an incompatibility between you two, I feel. You're just, you, I feel like you two are not at the same level. I feel like someone has more experience here than the other person. The other person is a little more naive or just young. I feel like you're the older one, Sagittarius. Um, again, doesn't have to be age, but it could just be in maturity. When it comes to maturity, I do feel like you're the older one here with the emperor being at the center. Um, again, I feel like you have feelings for this person, but I feel like you're being very smart. You're being very intelligent. You're being very wise. Um, you're holding back from from this person. You're... you're you're elevating your standards with the Nine of Pentacles. You're elevating your your self worth or your um, your dignity could be. Yeah, you're keeping your dignity high or your principles and or your and your morals. The Hierophant isn't here, but I can feel the Hierophant energy there is a relationship that I feel like you want to have with this person but I'm not sure that it's um, anything committed I feel like you want to have something um, something small I want to say it's with the page of pentacles almost like you just want to have a friendship relationship with this person you want you want to be friendly with this person or you want or you want um both both of you to be friendly towards each other you definitely don't want you don't you definitely don't want hostility or animosity here um, but I don't feel like you want to jump into anything serious with the emperor. You feel like you feel like it's your duty to maintain yourself um, balanced and stable, um, and to do the right thing. I feel like you're just being very careful. It's like you're being very careful with this person. You're being very careful with your actions and with your words. Mm. You're not, you're avoiding making any false promises. Mm -hmm. Or making, yeah, or making, or saying things that are unrealistic or acting in a way that's, that is unrealistic. You do feel like this person is keeping secrets from you or they're not communicating honestly to you. And I feel like that's a lot. That's why you're being so careful because you do feel like this person is holding a lot of secrets and they're not opening up to you um, emotionally. So you are feeling like you need to protect yourself. Okay. But again, I do f I can see and sense the attraction that there is between you two. There is this connection here between you two. Um, however, again, I feel like with the Nine of Pentacles, I feel like you're you're at a different level than this person is, and it's almost like you don't want to abuse your your power. It's like you have more power than this person has. 
in some way. You carry more power or you carry more authority or again cuz cuz because of age could be because of age um or your status is just higher in life in some way and i feel like you're being very careful not to abuse that so i do feel like you're keeping yourself distant with this person but at the same time you don't want this person to disappear from your life or you don't want to to lose this person i still feel like you want to maintain a certain relationship with them even if it's not romantic or even if it's not a commitment hmm. all right sagittarius so i hope that made sense to you i hope it resonated if it did please give me a thumbs up i really appreciate that thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye guys take care